When I was a child, my favorite story was the little engine that thought he could. Hi, John Maxwell here. Welcome to Minute with Maxwell. And that little story of the engine that thought that he could brings me to a principle of persistence. You know the story, don't you? It's the big hill and the little engine, and that, that hill looked awfully intimidating and big, the engine, but he started and got a good run on the level tracks to start going up the hill and kept saying all the way up, I think I can, I think I can, I think I can. And as he kept going up higher and higher, it got harder and he went slower and just barely moving at the top when he got there. Whew, I thought I could. I love the story. And it's a beautiful story of what persistence will do for us. You see, persistence has as its motivation anticipation. You show me a person that is persistent, who stays with the job longer than others, doesn't quit. And I'll show you a person who has a great sense of anticipation. Anticipation keeps me in the game. I can be persistent as long as I think that there's answer. I can think that there's light at the end of the tunnel. I think that I'm going to find my way. It's that anticipation that keeps us being persistent. And to be honest with you, persistence is the great separator. Recently, they did a survey of which they, they put out 10 people into a room and they asked them to think of this idea and get creative with it and maximize it as much as they could. And now or after they were in this conversation, they removed five of them. But before they removed the five, they had the discussion and they, they got the best formed idea that the 10 of them could do. They removed five of them and left five left. The five that were left behind, they had another hour to stay on the same idea to see if they could improve it even more than the 10 had done in the first hour. In every case, the five that stayed behind and worked another hour came up with a better idea and a higher idea than those who left after the first hour. Fewer people, but better depth and a better answer. Now, why was that? Was it the fact that the five that left weren't as smart as the five that stayed? No, it had nothing to do with any of that. It had everything to do with if you'll stay with something a little bit longer, the odds are very high that it will get better. And that's the strength of persistence. Persistence makes us better. The question you and I have to ask ourselves is, what have we stopped doing that shortcut us and kept us from reaching a level of potential that we do not know? The next time you're tempted to quit, just remember the story. Give it another hour. I promise you, persistence pays. Thanks for being with me today on Minute with Maxwell.